There are currently way too many players that only run metaguns like HKs and vectors. Let's talk about that. Okay, in this video I'm going to discuss why players use these guns slash ammo, why I think some of these people need to change, and of course, my experience with these weapons. Okay, I want to start by saying, I think people should be having fun in Tarkov, so if running M4s and HKs is the most fun thing to you, then do it and don't give a fuck what other people think. I love running metaguns too, however this video is for a very different set of people, the people who use guns like HKs and vectors because they need it in order to win PvP, they crutch OP guns in order to come out on top and inflate their ego. And again, I don't think they should be judged because of that, especially since Tarkov is such a hard game and players will naturally be drawn to things that will aid them. But you can't grow and become a well-rounded player if you only use guns that are considered OP. So I suppose you need to ask yourself, why are you playing Tarkov? For PvP? For the survival aspect? Or maybe even for Milsim? Most players will largely say the PvP, and if that's you, you have to ask yourself, do I need the assistance of an overpowered gun to win my fights? And if you think so, then obviously you need to improve as a player in whatever sense that may be. If you honestly don't think that applies to you, then that's fair enough, and you should be enjoying the game with whatever gun you want. You might watch Landmark, Toothy, or Willers and all of them either consistently use what people would consider OP, or when in the case of Willers, then sometimes. However, it's very transparent that they don't need to use those guns in order to win their fights. While they're playing, they're using game sense and positioning to give themselves the upper hand for the gunfight prior to even shooting a bullet. Laomok's HK may be meta, but we've all seen those clips of him using meme guns and shredding. Enhance. He earned the right to use meta guns without criticism. When it comes to ammo, I can agree that you should always use the best ammo possible, especially when the game's in the state it's in right now, where everyone's using an Alton, and anything less than M995 or M61 just doesn't do the job. But regardless, in most cases, these top tier PvP players are hitting headshots on enemies anyway, and tracking them effectively, so even if they do have a face shield, they're still likely to kill them. Like I said, if you think you're a new player who crutches OP or meta guns in order to win gunfights, then stick around. I truly believe that using a variety of weapons, attachments and sights will help you grow as a player much faster. Also developing your skills more broadly than just being good with a HK. If you only use quick time to kill guns, you can only be good with them, not with anything else. So why should you be good with other guns that are quote unquote worse? Well, for one, as I said, the variety helps you become more well-rounded your opportunities are opened up more, and also you'll undoubtedly have more fun when you're crushing players in PvP with guns that are supposedly trash. My favourite examples being the Sega 9 and the ADAR. Also as a plus, my trigger finger improves making me better with other OP guns like the SR25, which just adds more skills to the arsenal. I mean there's also a point to be made that you should use a variety of guns for the sake of not feeling repetitive, making every session of Tarkov feel different to the next. Of course this is just preference, however just doing the same thing over and over in any game can get boring. A big issue is that players get very comfortable around halfway into the wipe as they can afford whatever they want, often meta, and they can have it whenever they want. This is an issue because the next wipe comes around and they have to use a low budget AK and bad ammo, since they've become so comfortable using high end stuff, they struggle a lot and lose a lot of gunfights. Lastly, if everyone is using endgame gear all the time, then the TTK or time to kill of everyone is so long, then it becomes a different game altogether, effectively ruining the flow of Tarkov gunfights and players resort to abusing Altons and can finance it with their money that was easily made overnight by their Bitcoin farm. Be Like I said, it's no secret that I like using metaguns. 
it's fun to use something very powerful, and it's often a gun that I like using in other games too, meaning I'm likely to have a bias towards it. Another point is that metaguns look cool. On the other hand, budget guns don't. At all. <sighs> Some players like to take the viewpoint that, in games, if there's an overpowered mechanic in the game, they're going to use it because, well, it's in the game. I don't like that viewpoint being used all the time, however, I can agree that it makes me curious as to how these guns perform, and if you really do need skill to use them. I think this is an important time to note that, yes, I clearly do think HKs and Vectors are overkill. However, not just any idiot can wield them, and it doesn't make you good at the game when you use good gear, you still have to have mechanics and experience. On the other hand, I do believe it ruins the concept of skill gaps, due to the fact that players much worse than you can just hold mouse 1 with a 60 round HK and kill you with the last bullet. Okay, well that's pretty much all I had to say about that, so if you use guns like these a lot, then maybe just try and give it a break once in a while, that's all. For the remainder of the video, I'll just edit some of my recent clips. If you want to see it, then sit back and enjoy. Have a good rest of your day. Tell me when you're at Vault Door. Okay. Slow walking in me. I think I think there's one in Vault. Dead. You got him? Yeah, I got him. Okay, I want to take vault, so I'm gonna take vault. Okay. Yep, I'm down on my side. Dead. Yeah, I'm set. Go on. More running. shooting was but if I had to guess it would probably be X. Oh I got a scab here. That's good. Oh Somebody in Ollie. He just lit me up. Fuck me. Yeah. It's a team of two, one's dead. Okay I'm coming. Just a second. I think the second one's dead. Nope. Oh my ammo. I'm going to I've got no ammo! I've got no ammo! You killed me. Huh? You killed me. Oh, fuck me. Sorry. I thought he, he killed you, so I was just spraying. <laughs> 